How's it going guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to fix your gaming laptop's FPS being capped while gaming on battery. A while ago I was gaming on my laptop and I was gaming on battery. The FPS was capped at 30 and it might be 30 for you, it might be 60, it might be anything in between. Regardless, I'm going to show you how to solve that issue today. Without further ado, let's roll the video. Alright everyone, so as you can see, we're running around in the creative hub. It would be the same if we were playing Team Rumble or Solos, it's just I'm not planning on playing out a full game. But we're running around in the creative hub in Fortnite, and we're getting 30 FPS locked at 30. We can tell that we could get more FPS because we're not budging from 30. We're not dropping to 29. Even if I do some crazy stuff, the laptop still wants to do more, but it's being held back by something. We're not capped at 30 FPS in game. We're actually unlimited in game. It would be the same in any game. It'd be the same in GTA. It would be the same in Forza. In any game you'd play, you'd be capped at 30 FPS. I don't have time to go and show all of you guys the different games. You'd just be capped at 30 FPS no matter what game it is. So first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to return to lobby and close the game all right and now once you're back on your desktop you can go ahead and minimize the epic launcher if you want search for geforce experience go ahead and open that and first of all if you haven't already make sure your drivers are up to date because that's just good practice and that will help you improve your fps in general and then once you've done that go ahead and go over to settings and then scroll down to battery boost what battery boost does is it boosts the battery life of your laptop by capping your fps so as you can see here we're at 30 fps if you have a 60 hertz laptop like me put it at 60 fps if you have a 144 hertz laptop just go ahead turn it off and cap at 144 or whatever 60 fps for my laptop is realistically good enough just for all intents and purposes i'm gonna go ahead and turn it off now once this is off we can go ahead and relaunch fortnite and you can go ahead and close this window if you would like Alrighty, so here we are in the same hub as you can see we are getting up over 100 fps now even up into the 140s this is not a stable at how well my gaming laptop performs itself if you have a better laptop it'll perform better you could be getting over 200 fps if you have a worse laptop you'll be getting less so on and so forth but this video the only intent is to show you how to fix the battery cap as you can see we're up over 120 fps and down here you can see we're still on battery so you can go ahead and play all of your games whether it's fortnite valorant gta whatever normally at high fps now and you can play fortnite competitively or whatever but yeah that's pretty much it all right guys and that's it all you got to do is open up a video control panel and turn battery boost off if you guys found this video entertaining useful or informative in any way shape or form please go ahead drop a like on it and subscribe i'll see y'all next time peace out